so happy. I'm from New Jersey. I'm from Pennsylvania. I am from Detroit, Michigan. I'm from Laramie, Wyoming. First off, that answer is easy. What I would eat every day, because it'd be toaster strudels. And I, I didn't have them for a month, and then I ate them this morning, and I feel amazing. I like falafel. I eat bananas a lot. I do that. And I eat eggs a lot. I'm Italian, so I love pasta. Pasta, pizza, bread. Mom's like chicken casserole. Steak, cheeseburgers, um, maybe a salad. Dig it. I don't really know what's inside of it. it. Looks like there's like white spots in it. So I think it's like, it looks like grated cheese. Yet again, not too sure. I can't smell anything. It's not aromatic. It's probably not fresh. It looks like there's a lot of grease in it. Something you would probably expect to find it someplace at past midnight at a college town. It didn't quite taste like that though. Like tomato-y, I think. It's super good, I like it. Yeah, it tastes kind of like a salsa, but a different texture. Pretty normal, I'd say. Is that yam? Is that a sweet potato? That's a sweet potato. That tastes like a sweet potato. <laughs> 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 um, I have no idea what the sauce is. Like, absolutely no idea. It's kind of sweet. A little, I feel a little bit of spiciness, and I'm assuming that's from the sauce because sweet potatoes and black beans are not very spicy. This one's more, most colorful. <laughs> All the other ones, these are very monochromatic. Yummy! It feels uh, substantial. Okay, it looks like sweet potato. Sweet potato, like black beans. Ooh, it's good. It's like a bean burrito. Um, I'm a more of a pinto man myself. As far as the orange, chunks in it. I want to say squash. Um, this is chocolate cake. I'm pretty sure, although you cannot tell me, pretty sure it's vegan chocolate cake. It tastes like a regular cake. It doesn't taste like processed food cakes like I buy at like grocery stores, so that's pretty cool. That's like a cake, cake thing, but uh, more like a brownie. It's a little denser. Yeah, super good. Like a brownie or chocolate cake. And that just tastes like Normal uh, Betty Crocker chocolate cake mix. I wouldn't say that I have like a least favorite okay. because it's all really good, but I really do like cake. <laughs> so I might have to go with that as just my favorite. Yeah, I liked all of it. I liked all of them. I really liked this. Very different. Um, Super tasty, good flavor. And I liked like the potato burrito. That was interesting. I've never had something like that. It's good. Good, but they taste like something I would uh, need, eat on a normal basis. They seem like normal food items to me. I knew it. Okay, I'm happy. <laughs> As I figured. <laughs> I just didn't know what to call it. That I actually like kind of thought there could have been dairy because yeah. it tastes very creamy. That maybe because it's a little drier, but still good. Mm -hmm. um, that I knew there wasn't meat in. Couldn't tell. Nothing stood out to me that red flags like, hey, there's no, it's missing something. Oh, yeah. Definitely. I mean, Granted, I have like financial ability to do so, I would totally do it because I like this kind of food. If it's good food, it's good food. I think also for me, I don't like to prepare food and I feel like that might involve a bit of preparation. I microwave and toast things. Those are my specialties. Oh yeah? The thing I, I would always say is be adventurous, especially in your foods. Try new things, see if you like it. If you don't, do something else. Yeah, like if once a week I could definitely do it. 
Oh yeah, of course. I think you kind of have to have some sort of consideration, but I mean, I'd hope that most restaurants have something vegetarian or vegan. I think it's concatenated with hippies and uh, anarchists. I feel bad for them because they get such a bad rap, especially out in the West. I think it's perfectly fine. I know um, I have some very good friends who are uh, vegetarian and vegan, and um, I think a lot of people's first reaction is that we, you have to almost accommodate for them as they go out and eat, but as you've shown here that you can make a lot of things work and pretty soon it just becomes part of, it's, it's normal now.